meditation it is a very popular word nowadays but you know many people don't understand the meaning of meditation i have seen in many places like people are getting training on meditation and one person is seeing what other person is doing then again changing their posture and all these things actually you know first we need to understand what is meditation meditation is basically allowing the thoughts feelings or sensation to pass while maintaining a mental stance without any judgment or analysis just let the things pass simple way i am not get into details all those you know this uh, seven uh, points like base spleen heart throat third eye and all these things i'm just i'll talk on meditation very simple way so that anybody can understand and simple way what are the faq of meditation frequently asked questions now the first is place for meditation is there any specific place needed for meditation or requirement for the place big no anywhere you can do meditation on the ground on any place on jungle on water anywhere on desert anywhere you can do meditation in single in a the group of people you can do meditations now is there any posture for meditation like i have to sit like that i have to sit like that no there is no posture actually there is no rule for posture of meditation no rule just be comfortable the way you are sitting or even standing i'll come up that how meditation whether can be done in standing position actually there is no rule you can sit at the sea beach you can leaning with something wherever you can just be relax now is there any time for meditation or any time we can do meditation no rule actually just be least disturbed while you are planning to do meditation just let that there are a lot of not noise lot of external physical disturbance is not there but scientifically it is said that there is a time range between 4 am to 5 30 am which is a uh, call uh, brahma muhurta so that can be a very uh, suitable time but not necessary any time anywhere you can do meditation now another question many people ask this during meditation we should sit in front of something any goddess or any any uh, you know uh, candle or something no nothing physically need to be in front of you but to be mentally there should be something in your uh, uh, mind actually like or some people have a question whether meditation can be done only in sitting posture no few years back i have uh, read a book called walking meditation it was very interesting even on that time onwards i have learned only that meditation can be possible when you are walking even in any any situation actually it is not only you are sitting that meditation can be possible now the question is who should do meditation i have talked with many people they said meditation uh, you know i am not interested or it will not give any benefit for me it, it is for the uh, you know other kind of people so who should do meditation actually everybody can do meditation from you know child from teenager from adult anyone can do meditation actually even mother can do meditation with the kids along with small kids like that even the honeymoon couple they are going to beach they can do meditation over there also so there who should do and who shouldn't do there is no rule actually as you know as i'm a mechanical engineer so i always uh, try to learn everything scientifically and technically you know which can be uh, technically analyzed can be proven like that so there is a we all know in medical testing like ecg or you know echocardiographic there are a lot of channel eight channel 12 channel you know that uh, electronic circuit or chips uh, sensor basically that uh, placed in different part of our body and they get the sense in a graphical paper isn't it so there is a when a person doing meditation or right state of mind in meditations so there is a special uh, testing process which is much much higher level than the ecg or echocardiography which is called 128 channel eeg recorded you know in uh, it was uh, sometimes i'll show you the video 
it was uh, tested on uh, many uh, tibetan buddhist practitioner who were you know very ma master in uh, doing meditation and all these things and it, it, it has seen that it has uh, during when somebody is in a good uh, uh, state of meditation they are you know gamma activity in from the brain is very very high and very uh, you know strong actually what i mean to say is uh, during meditation there are a lot of activity in the brain got to increase a lot of uh, you know concentration power etc get in improved actually and many people say that what what will happen actually if we do meditation we spend a lot of times and energy on meditation what are the benefit actually benefit is it improves your concentration power it reduces the you know depression if somebody in depression meditation will definitely help a reduction the oxygen consumption in the body actually it reduces the aggression or aggressiveness in our mind actually it reduces narcissism disorder that is a personality disorder called narcissism which is basically i based i am that i am that you know so there are many people actually they are very busy with them only they don't see other people in the world actually this is called narcissistic uh, personality disorder so if somebody do the uh, meditation that reduces narcissism personality disorder it improves the emotional stability in short it improves the quality of life thank you so much for your attention and time